Hey guys, Nicole here and welcome back to YouTube Gamers. Today we're going through everything we know so far about the world of Pokemon Arceus. As an avid Pokemon lover, I'm super excited for Arceus, even with all the changes Nintendo is making in the new addition to the series. As always, make sure to leave a like and comment below if you enjoyed the video and be sure to subscribe for more news and updates on Arceus and more games coming in 2022. Now let's get into it. Going off what details Nintendo has released so far, this game will take us to the earliest point in the history of the Pokemon series, into a land known as the Hisui region. This region is actually Pokemon's modern day Sinnoh region, which was the setting of the fourth generation of Pokemon games, Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum. Pokemon Arceus is basically the Pokemon series we know and love mixed with Breath of the Wild. This new game will be a sort of open world with lots of opportunity to explore while also basing the storyline on the lore of Pokemon. Arceus takes us back to the very beginning in what Game Freak describes as a long gone era. From the trailer, we can see that this region isn't the small town and big cities we're used to, but a region that is mostly wilderness. We can also notice that we can actually see Pokemon roaming the wilderness, which will be a breath of fresh air in the series. It's a very different concept than what we're used to from previous installments in the series, and it's also believed that Arceus takes place in a time period where Pokemon trainers, gym badges, and the Elite Four weren't even a thought. Their most recent trailer confirms this to be true by stating that this adventure is a tale when Pokemon and humans live separate lives. What does this mean for us? Game Freak tells us that the goal in the game will be to create the first ever Pokédex, meaning we will have to travel across the entire region through rainfall, desert lands, mountains, and snowy climates in order to discover every single Pokémon that's out there. One of the biggest questions about the game is whether or not it will be fully open world. Unfortunately, fans will not be getting the open world experience they were expecting, but will operate in a similar manner to the Monster Hunter series, where players will be sent out from their central location of Jubilee Village to a specified zone area to complete their work. Jubilee Village is home to the Galaxy Team, which has been reported to be made up of various people from different regions. We will apparently meet more and more leaders from the Galaxy Team in Hisui as we progress through the story. However, it looks like you will see Captain Silene the most, who is the leader of the Survey Division of the Galaxy Team and will be the one overseeing your work on the Pokedex. Sadly, we will not be able to freely travel between the different designated zones as players will have to return to Jubilee Village once their task is completed. It is disappointing for sure, especially when comparing Arceus to Breath of the Wild and other open world games, but I guess we'll just have to wait and see if Game Freak can keep their promise that this game will give us an adventure unlike anything we've experienced before. And that wraps up this video on what we know so far about the world of Arceus. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like and let us know in the comments section what you're most excited for in the new Pokemon Arceus. As always, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more news and updates on Pokemon Arceus and more games coming out this year. See you next time.